Ciao Juventini of the world, my name is Giuseppe, welcome back on the channel. Breaking news, we have a new number 3. And what a number 3, after having the name stamped of the new shirt of Giorgio Chiellini, eternal captain after 17 season, the name will probably fade away and we will replace it with a new one. Because now, all the journeys are speaking about the Don deal, and what a Don deal. 25 years old, player from Torino, Torino is playing in the same city as as Juventus Derby, Derby della Mole, Gleison Bremer is a new Juve player. He has chosen after waiting for so long from Inter, after promising him with Inter, after finding the agreement in terms of salary, he was just waiting to go to Inter. Apparently there were even some rumors that he already found a house there in Milano. Everything is changing because Juventus, they went with a big acceleration before even another announcing officially Matthias De Ligt to Bayern and cashing in the money, they really went in an acceleration mode, they were asking respect and we will come on that, they were demanding respect on the media, but also towards the other fans, towards the other clubs, they went with the big balls on the Mercato, Maurizio Arriva Bene, Cherubini, with a lot of money, yes, but they went and they made sure that we secured one of the best, if not, Actually, we have to say the best defender of 21-22. What a defender. I am super happy. Is he the successor of Matthias De Ligt? Is he the successor of Chiellini? Will we have more? I don't know at the moment. But what Juventus did right now, entering in a few days and breaking the promise of Gleison Bremer to Inter is something crazy. We have to admit it. I told you that Mercato would have been crazy. I was expecting it. I was probably not expecting it like that. In the hot days with the weather that we are all experienced in UK, in the Netherlands, in Belgium, in USA, in Texas, everywhere in the world we are all suffering from having a lot of warm because it's 40 degree to 42 degree but there is only one part of the world or I have to say there is only one part of the population that is freezing at the moment we are speaking about interisti it's not a mystery it's not a hazard that Bremer is starting with two letters with a B and with a R because we can say brrr, brrr, because Inter is freezing after seeing yesterday their new number 21 Paolo Dybala taking the shirt of Roma with the number 21. Today they see their new number 3. Bremer going uh, to Juve and probably also taking the number 3. Mamma mia. Freezing temperatures for uh, Inter. It is probably a disaster for them. I believe that Juventus going and hijacking Bremer is really a power sign. A power sign in different ways. We will start explaining why it's a sign of power for Juventus. First of all, because we are showing Showing that we are not weak. Yes, Matthias De Ligt has chosen for another league, for another top club as Bayern Munich. We understood it, we took care of the situation. Juventus is not improvising. Juventus is not saying, let's sell him and then we will see what we do. If Juventus gave the agreement after refusing from Bayern Munich the first initial proposing, after sending back Chelsea with a really strange proposal of 40 million with uh, Werder, uh, Werner, uh, we could have been Werder Bremer, but it is what it is. But in, when, when we put them at home again, we were really solid and hard and we said, no, we don't negotiate with numbers that we don't want to. We want our numbers that still need to be officialized. Will it be 70 plus 10? Will it be 70 plus 15? Will it be? I don't know. But Juventus, according to the books, according to the limits that they already fixed for themselves, they were resisting. Sign of power towards a European club like Bayern Munich. We gave away Matthias De Ligt, but that's what I tell you, Juventus is not improvising. Sometimes they can miss on a player, they can have a bad judgment. Sometimes they can miss a strategy. Ronaldo, was it a good or a bad strategy? You can question that. You can maybe uh, be wrong on a player. Ramsey, Rabiot, giving a lot of salary for these players, even if you knew, for example, that a Ramsey was injury prone. You can make mistakes, but Juventus is not someone that is going with improvisation. If they gave the agreement for Bayern Munich to take the lead, it's because they already had the replacement. We will have to be honest here. Who was the first target of Juventus, the priority, the dream signing, it was Koulibaly. Koulibaly, next to the league, 
or next to Bonucci, who cares? He was the number one. After Chelsea going for the player and probably paying too much in terms of salary, 10 million a season plus 40 million for a player that is one that had one more year of contract. Hey, Juventus, they went for the number two on the list. And what a number two. Because if we couldn't go for Koulibaly, probably Bremer was the next in line. And it's not a mystery that he was the best defender of 21-22. Gleison Bremer, sportingly, is also a really, really, really great one. A great signature for Juve. Because we were looking for someone that is super physical, that is aggressive, that can go and man mark. Probably something where... Where Bonucci is lacking. We remember the big fights between Bonucci and strikers like Lukaku, but especially Zapata, where Bonucci was suffering. We were needing someone that was able to do that, like Giorgio Chiellini was doing it, but also in a certain way, Matthias de Ligt. We have found the best possible European man marker that we saw last season. Gleison Bremer, he promised him himself to Inter. He was waiting for them. He had everything as a done deal with Inter, but he couldn't wait anymore because it was too long. What happened is that Inter, they had an agreement with the player on the salary for 3 million euro per year. Uh, Juventus went and they gave him 4 million plus one of bonus per year. A lot of salary for a player that needs to be shown and also to show what he's able to do in Europe. Absolutely yes, we agree. But I believe that it's according to standards, it's okay. 4 plus 1 and pay attention because the Ligt was not reaching all the objective last year. So they will have to show it on the field that he deserved that bonus of plus 1. If we are able again to go in, in lift silverware, that's one thing. Appearances on the field, his performances will be monitored to reach that plus 1. But anyway, they went to the player, to the entourage and they gave more salary... <coughs> That what Inter was proposing, I'm sorry. Not only in terms of salary, but also in terms of the money that they wanted to pay for the transfer fee. We know that Inter was blocked at 30 million plus the loan of a young player like Cassede. Juventus, they went and they go and apparently they are speaking about the 40 plus 7. So we are reaching really high transfer fee here. But we were obliged. We were not discussing with 1 million more, 1 million less. No, we went immediately with a big offer, a solid offer to say we demand respect not only on the media not only on the field with VR but also on the Mercato Juventus they can do whatever they want because we are the strongest team in Italy of course we are rebuilding towards the European respect that we have to gain and how will we do that with the performance in Champions League but that starts with a Mercato with balls after Pogba after Di Maria, we have now Bremer. Three instant players that Allegri was asking for. We know it. Koulibaly should have been the cherry on the cake. It is not Koulibaly. It is Bremer. I am not disappointed, my friends. I have to admit that we have already three big players and the Mercato is not over. You will come back to me with, what about the left back? What about the Vice Vlaovic? They are speaking about maybe another ex Torino joining. Belotti for free. Having him for free will also, again, give him give us a bit more room to spend for other parts of the field. Maybe on the fullbacks, even if I personally don't believe that that will be taken care of this season, but maybe from next season, but maybe adding another player in the middle of the field. Is it Paredes? Is it a big surprise name? Mercato is crazy, we can expect everything. Guys, we will go into the analyze of that new signing a bit later Tonight, maybe, or tomorrow, when it's apparently rumored that Bremer should have already his medicals before going with the team to USA. We will go on that, but what do we have to keep in memory of that done deal is that Juventus, they showed that when they wanted the player, they can do it. They were not waiting. People were asking Juve to go fast. They went fast in selling the league and finding the replacement after trying for Koulibaly. And giving up, they understood that Bremer was number one. They went with really solid arguments, that one. And then we already have secured the best defender of 21-22 for our team. I am excited. I am proud of my Juventus. It's not over. We need to continue building on what we are doing. We will find each other later. Put a maximum of likes just to show how much you are happy about Gleison Bremer to Juventus. Grazie, forza. Juventus.